Hello everyone. Today we're going to see if these hex bug fish will swim in this generic Windex glass cleaner. Ooh. Now I, I purchased the absolute cheapest glass cleaner I could find at Walmart. They had Windex for six dollars. They had great value for three and I purchased this super generic <laughs> with ammonia for uh, it's two liters. It's really heavy and it uh, was just two dollars. So let's go ahead and pull up our filthy, filthy bowl. This is, it's really gross and sticky they from all the... They never clean it. I know, they never clean it. You know what would be nice? The Windex will clean it. Oh yeah. The Windex and the agitating power of the fish. Yeah. And the little flippers and fins will clean it. So let's yes. go ahead and dump... Oh, I have to be careful. I put a cheap quilt underneath this table here. I'm hoping uh, we don't spill. I've got 64 ounces. I'm not sure if I'll use this whole thing. I don't know if that would fit in the bowl. Yeah, Actually, it might. Oh, that smells so cheap, the ammonia. Boy, it smells like, like almost like pee. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and... Ugh. That's strong. It's strong. It's a really strong smell. That's a pretty blue, isn't it? Yeah. I think that's sufficient. I left about a quarter of the bottle. <laughs> All the little, like, flaky things that were in the bottom of the bowl. Ew, like, so, right so gross. It's, like, it's, around. it's so gross. All the flaky, gross, like milk and different things. They're all full. Well, we're getting the bowl clean. That's a good thing. Yeah. And the agitating power of the fish will clean the bowl. Our fish will be clean as well. Yeah, let me get these out of this soap dish. It's gross. I think the soap dish is kind of gross. It's from, uh, I think this is from uh, Kool Aid or something. I forgot oh, what we yeah. did. Oh, yeah, we did um, that. Fruit punch stuff. Oh, that's really, it called? that's, you know, we, we need to clean up after ourselves. <laughs> really pig-like. I think one of these isn't working. I'm just going to go ahead and put them in and I'm hoping the ammonia and the cleaning doesn't destroy these. We've got like, what, $40, $30 worth of fish here? Yeah. One, two, seven, one, two, three, four, seven fish. And one of them, I think, I think the gold one here isn't working, but I'm just going to put them all in. Oh yeah, baby, go. Clean our bowl. Ew. Why are you touching it? Oh, I've got to get the, the, the magnets. Hopefully it doesn't stain them. Can you give me a few Kleenex, honey bug? Yeah. Okay. All right. They're really, they're really, I, it's so gross. Ew. You it's like slime. Making Kleenex. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's gross. It's like a snot. <laughs> My daughter, nothing but the best. My daughter brought some Mickey Mouse Kleenex. This is in the other room. Yes. Why do we have those? I don't know. Um, for, the, for these videos, I don't know. <laughs> they're just randomly in there. You know what? They're all. I think they're all working. Let me see how we're doing. Did it stain any of them? Like, like pull them out? No. This one. This one. I've got to replace the battery on. I got to put him separate. So we'll put him over here. Yeah, I'm gonna have clean fingernails in a minute. <laughs> cool, I love a seahorse. Yeah. All right. Now science no longer has to research the fact that hex bug fish swimming Windex. It, we have done the experimentation. Yes, thank you. They're doing. They're really churning up some nice suds, by the way. It's pretty. <laughs> yeah. If you want to, you know, it'd be great. Um, throw hex bug fish into a toilet and then put some toilet bowl <laughs> cleaner in. <laughs> They'll agitate it right up for you. Yeah. <laughs> they only seem to stop when the magnets get stuck together. Other than that, they're really working out well. Yeah. So, yes, they can swim. So, and, oh, don't try this at home, please. Yeah, I know. I don't want a kid to leave negative comments because, you know, some eight-year-old kid did this and he spilled Linux all over the rug. So, don't do this at home. This one kid, I don't know if he was joking, but he was like, like, he commented on one of the videos and he was like, um... It was the can I have some fish in soda mm -hmm. or like Pepsi or something, and he and um he was like I only ate and I tried this with my fish and he died. No, oh, jeez. Okay. Yeah, YouTube. Yeah. I like this one. He's got a little uh, he's got a fire in his belly. Like he said, he tried it with a real fish. Yeah. Okay. Hey, this is good for churning. Look. I'm trying to get his little red belly. I can't get his red light to see there it is. I think that's the red light. Yeah. Yeah, it's blinking. Okay. Look, you can't even see the fish are churning so much. Anyway. 
I'm hoping I'm gonna get these cleaned off and I'm hoping that uh, they'll work for the next video so stay tuned please like and subscribe because we do Hexbugs videos probably twice a month now please leave a comment if you can think of an interesting liquid <laughs> nothing dirty please don't say pee and poo yeah. um, something something fun like Windex I, I, kind of we've done over a dozen of these and trying to think of the next good video so like and subscribe thanks for watching and take care Bye. hello everyone a quick follow-up um, that generic Windex, I, I can't believe how well it cleaned. I just had to rinse this out. Look at how clean this bowl became. We've used yeah. this for so many videos. So if you have something that's dirty, buy a half gallon of Windex and put hex bug in. Put some hex bugs in and it'll still clean it right up, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. So thanks for watching and take care.